Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Nuclear Throne Ultra. This time we're going in as good old Humphrey and we are jumping in to try and get a secret Ultra. This time we just need to have hold of a director weapon when we finish the run, which shouldn't be too hard. We're starting out with the insanely good golden explosive crossbow. I actually can't believe this thing's a golden weapon. This might be one of the best ones. Plausible. But very happy to see it. But yes, director weapon. Um, we're going to have to probably just take one when we see one uh, and try and make it work. Because I, I don't remember getting many director weapons late into the runs. It's normally early in the runs that you see them. So we'll see. Uh, we could also get, the, get it by having zero skill. But I just don't think that's something that we could viably do very easily. So I'm not gonna I'm not going to play to that. I'm going to go for the director weapon. I think I have a lot more control over that. Because I can't exactly remember how skill works. I mean, I guess... I guess it's plausible to do if I just, like, stand still for a while, right? It just seems a little sketchy to do it that way. Seems a little sketchy. We've got a micro weapon there. The micro grenade is just... Oh, it's beautiful. It's such a good weapon. But this thing, this thing knows knows true power, so I'm going to stick with this for now. Um, Plutonium Hunger, of course, as always, is just god tier. Although it is getting a range decrease in an upcoming patch, which is honestly super, super understandable. It has more range than the base game by quite a bit. It's pretty noticeable. Okay. Be a little careful about the boss here. Um, that was a pretty stupid hit. I didn't realize this character only had 6 HP. I can't remember what my ability does now, to be honest. I, 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 I can spend skill to do stuff, but I... Oh, it stuns enemies. Okay, I can spend skill to stun enemies. So that's kind of nice. And I think skill increases my damage. Um, yeah, I think skill is a damage increase, isn't it? we got Puffy Cheeks on as well right now, so we can fire a little faster on occasion. I like that. Keep going through here. Pizza time straight away, why not? Still haven't seen a director weapon yet, so... We'll see how this goes. But like I said, we can potentially go to zero skill to do it as well. But I'm a little less comfortable with that idea because I don't know exactly how that's going to work. Right, good stuff there. We're already up to level 5 here. Very nice. Um, I'll take good old eagle eyes. That was rather nice. I am looking for, obviously, bolt marrow right now for this weapon. But apparently the game is not very comfortable giving me bolt marrow. Wow, this weapon, as a golden starting weapon, is intensely amazing. No bouncy shots for me, thank you. Thank you. Oh my goodness. We are leveling up so fast right now. Um, boiling veins is probably a good idea right now, but of course I'm going to go for open mind. Look at that. Three rad canisters right off the bat. That's what you like to see, baby. Oh my god, is that a bouncer? A good old bouncer bazooka, what, what everyone's looking for. Oh! I did not think that would kill me, my bad. Okay, fair enough. But yeah, we might want to go for uh, Rhino Skin, considering this guy does start with lower HP. Might be a good idea. But yeah, obviously looking for Bolt Marrow if we can get it. Chill out, my guy. Gimme, gimme, gimme a director weapon. So there's, there's Rhino skin, so I think we should just take that. Makes our life a lot easier, and potential for death is severely reduced, I'd say. Because the uh, any, any character to start with lower than normal HP is at severe risk. Because I feel like having the normal amount of HP at 8 is like the perfect amount normally. Um, we'll go with this for the extra damage. Beautiful. Oh, the explosions, baby. 
I mean, I could also go with Mood Swing with this thing for the extra, um, the extra explosive power. Explosions burn, I think is what, what it does. That could be interesting. Uh, but there's Bolt Marrow. Good, good. We'll stick with that for now, then. Okay. Still got to be careful, though. Bolt Marrow actually does add some risk, because now the bolts aren't as predictable. So it does add some risk to the game. We've got to be a little wary of. And for the most part, it shouldn't make too much of a difference. It's just, like I said, something I've got to think about. I don't even know what happened there. Okay. Into the pieces here as we go. Bounce or crossbow could be fun, but the explosive one steals my heart. Beautiful stuff. See, there's Mood Swing. We go with Mood Swing now as well. Yes, there you go. Explosions burn. We like that. Wow. <laughs> the damage output here with uh, scarier faces is pretty wild. I like it. Really, there's another enemy all the way back here. Do you have to make my Walter White so sad? Wait, what? Oh, it's a, that's what it was. I was like, what, what's the enemy here? It's a goddamn mimic. You fool. Of course it was a mimic. Um, Probably go for adrenaline fuel here. Makes ammo a lot easier. I need to test something after this stage to see how I'm going to work around this skill. I, I was just about to say skill issue then. Not in that way. Not my, It's not my skill issue we're working around. I do not have a skill issue. Right. Okay, skill does not go down at the end of a level. So this, this does mean we pretty much need a director weapon. But I'm not seeing one at the moment, which I'm a bit worried about. So I'm not quite sure how the, all this is going to go down. Right. Things are going okay so far, though, in terms of progressing through the levels. I just can't believe we've not found a director weapon yet. We're finding so many weapons per stage. We should be finding director weapons. Um, Plutonium Hunger. Yes, please. Exit straight away here. We are at zero skill at the moment, mind you, so... I just need to get a better understanding of how I can let my skill go. Oh, that's a Mimic. How dare you? Number one, how dare you? Okay, this shouldn't be too difficult, I wouldn't think. This guy should die pretty quick. Should be wary of where the fire is. Adrenaline fuel will keep our ammo going. There you go. Taken care of. Good. These guys can be nightmare fuels. Let's be careful. What do you mimics, man? Gats to chill with the mimics. I don't know if it's going to happen, you know. I, I just don't know the best way to get my skill down unless I can just spend it all. Let's try that at the end of the stage. Oh, that was a very bad hit. That was another very bad hit. I need to be careful here. I am losing the will to live. <laughs> no, just losing the ability to live is all. Right, let me try something here. I, d I did it wrong, though. Um... Throne butt, skill decrease 25% slower. Oh, nah. Oh, we can also get hit to lose skill as well, which is understandable. Um, herming? A little bit of extra herming. So can I just... No, I can't use my ability inside of, like, in between areas. I'm going to have to be really careful about how I do this. I don't exactly know how I'm going to get to zero skill. 
Because I, I just, I don't think the director weapon's the way to go right now, because clearly we're just not getting any. Need to chill out, my guy. I said chill out, my guy, Mr. Teapot. So let's try it with this stage. Oh my god, you're getting way too close to me for comfort, thank you. Okay, staying back for now. Big dog, I do not want to deal with you. I'm probably losing out on some good old rads here, but honestly, I'm scared, so... <laughs> That much. Okay, so I can let my skill go down to zero now. And then but then if I kill the enemy, it goes up. So how the hell would I ever finish on zero skill? I don't understand how that would work. I'm confused. And there's just no director weapons anywhere. Yeah, because as soon as I hit something, I gain skill, so I just don't really get how it's going to work. Also, I've almost died. I need to be a bit more aware of my current HP situation. It'd be nice if the game would drop some HP for me at some point. There you go, we got some. Do not like the dogs jumping at me when I have an explosive weapon, thank you very much. Is this going to be plausible at all? I don't even know. Because director weapons are just not coming my way at all here. So what's the best way to do this then? I can go down to, to like nearly zero skill. Let's take out you for a second. I just don't really have a way of killing stuff without... I want to be on zero skill, but... I don't know how I'm going to do this. Ooh, alien intestines could work. I don't know if that'll give me skill or not. Gamma Guts. Gamma Guts is actually probably better. I go for lightning here. Well, this is, this is the boss, though, so I, I don't know if I can do this. Yeah, I don't know how this is going to work. So I'm, I'm definitely going to be on really high skill when this guy dies, right? Maybe I just, like, try and keep my skills super low at all times. Try and get it as low as possible all the time. It's not exactly working the best for me right now, is it? I want this guy to die quickly, but actually he's died much quicker than this. Otherwise I'm gonna die. Alright, keep holding on to this. Please don't slam me into a wall. How is he not dead yet? Nah, see, I've hit level ultra and I'm a uh, this is how do how on earth can you possibly I'm very confused by this. When you have more than 200 skill and die, your death will be prevented, your skills will be reset. You can't gain um okay. Um I guess I'll go for this. But yeah, I, I don't... I, like, let me check the, the note again. One second. Good old Humphrey. Have zero skill or hold a director weapon. But how on earth would you hit ultra with zero skill? I don't understand how you'd possibly... That, that doesn't seem possible. 
because you can't spend skill after the stage is over, and you have to attack an enemy to kill it. So it doesn't make a right lot of sense to me right now, I'll be honest. It doesn't make a right lot of sense. But yeah, also, where the hell were all the director weapons that run? There was just none. Ow. Well, that's okay. We didn't want to be living there anyways. But yeah, I, I just... How are we going to do this? We don't have any director weapons that are gold, do we? I don't know how we're going to do this. The game just needs to give me a director weapon early on. I need to keep it. That's like the only way this is going to work. You can get some really good, like, late game director weapons, but they just seem really rare. Director weapons don't seem super common. Micro grenade. I'm going to use this for a bit because this thing's fun. Um, do, do a bit of extra feet. Why not? It seems like a weapon that I can get down with. This thing seems, definitely needs an accuracy up, but otherwise it's pretty fun. I will keep this going. Still no director weapons. I'm, I've got more chests and everything. Like, I've got a lot more opportunities to potentially see these director weapons. And they are just not manifesting. They are not giving themselves to me. Bouncer revolver. Gotta be a little careful when I'm doing this. Oh, there you go. Director rifle. Okay. So, unfortunately, now we'll probably have to stick with the director rifle, which I can't imagine is going to be the easiest. But we've got ways to make it better. Um, rhino skin, pretty necessary here. But we are going to have to go for a damage setup here, though. Otherwise, this thing's not going to be enough later on. Obviously, we might end up finding a better director weapon along the way now, but I can't count on that. I've got to act as if I'm probably going to have to use this director weapon. Okay. Okie dokie. Um, one second, hold up. Well, I mean, to be fair, there's still some more enemies about, apparently. I didn't realise. Okay, it doesn't matter. I thought we had an explosive weapon on this floor. We do not. Okay. Um, open mind, we'll take. But yeah, it's like, this is good, but not great sort of thing. We can do a good amount with this, but... It's not going to be nearly enough. Just got to be play it careful, play it cautious, and we should be okay. The weapon's doing us just fine right now. What is going on down here? The double disc gun. Yeah, don't you be stealing my ammo. Well, inverted area, here we come, I guess. Um, do we have anything that's going to make this weapon better? Not really. I guess trigger fingers is pretty good. Just should be able to fire it a bit faster. But it's not the, the solution, really, is it? It's just kind of a band-aid fix to this at the moment. We need more damage is what we need. Yeah, this is going to be rough. I'm probably going to die here. I'm going to need you guys to chill heavily. Oh, god damn. Chill out, sniper. Oh my god, so many horrible enemies there. Right, nothing, nothing I can use there. We can put bouncer on this though to make it a little better as well. The inverted area does help with that. I'm going to hope it went through the portal because otherwise I don't know what the hell it is. Um, and I guess Rage could be good here as well. Let's take Rage. We do get another uh, weapon mute here. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I, I, I overcommitted to that area then. Oh my 
God, I need to be a little more careful. Oop. Oh, wait, no, no, no. That's just a bouncer assault rifle. My bad. I don't know where the director one went. I've lost it. This is going to be rough. All oh, the micro missiles. God damn it. Where did my director weapon go? Oh, no. I've just got it as a secondary weapon. I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm stupid. Swarm on it there. Okay, it's turned to something a bit better now. I'm still a bit worried, though. Bouncer and Swarm does not fix all of our problems here. As you can see, the big enemies are still taking quite a bit of work to kill. Try and stay out the way of everything, but also don't lose out on rads. <laughs> okay. No more better director weapons here. Looks like we're going to be sticking with this thing. We are level 7 already, though, which is good. Um, tough Shell, I think, is just good defensively here for us. More HP and stuff. Ooh, I got hit by something there. I think the enemy hadn't quite died when I ran into it. Can these big bastards that fire a bunch of shots stop? It's not ideal for me, thank you. It's not ideal for me. Definitely could use some more ammo. Oop, wait a minute. Hold the phone. Ah, no, it doesn't matter. It went through the wrong portal. Okay, we're stuck in with what we got. And we're going to put frost on it as well. We've got director plasma gun here, but I think this thing with the setup we've got on it now is the better thing to take, even with it being lower level. Because we've actually got some good stuff on this thing now from weapon mutes. It seems worthwhile to sort of use this thing and keep it going. What on earth is going on down here? There's so many enemies for this being a boss arena. Calm down. This is... I'm definitely going to die in here. Ridiculous. Oh god, I've got a really itchy head. Ooh, some HP there is very, very nice. Finding it very, very hard to keep an eye on what's what, like what's what's real. <laughs> what's actually gonna damage me and stuff. I think we got him. Okay. Level 8 already. Okay. Um. I think I'm going to take Strong Spirit here just in case things go quite awry. Unfortunately, we have taken a path here which is not ideal for us. Right, just, just chill. The teapot guys need to chill. Oh my fucking life. There's so much going on right now. Things won't die. These things have so much health. Oh, out of ammo. There isn't any ammo anywhere. I guess I'll take this for now so that I can actually kill some stuff. The next stage with this little ammo is going to be rough. Oh, dude. Need to chill out with that. Okay. Level 8, nearly level 
Oh my god. This stage just scares the shit out of me because the enemies are so tough. And have so much HP. And then there's all these shots that go through walls as well. Just too much to keep an eye on. I don't even know what I've taken here. Bloodline. Bloodline's pretty good here. I wish I could keep the bloodline for the boss, but I cannot. Okay. Through we go. One more level to go. I don't even know if we're able to kill the boss here, which is scary. Um... I guess we go with Adrenaline Fuel here. And we just get out of here. We did manage to keep this though, which is very nice. I do not like the enclosed space that you have me in here. Very much like to leave this space. Oh no, I'm so fucked. You can chill out on all you. Okay, we got it. Oh my god, okay. One more level, hopefully. Now this thing is just gonna do, like, barely any damage to these enemies, so I've gotta be very, very cautious about who gets close to me. I am going to need another weapon here that has a different ammo type at some point. Otherwise, I'm going to run out of ammo pretty quick. Ow. Good hit. Health. Lovely. We got a bit of ammo out of that as well. Unfortunately, we're not going to level up this stage by the looks of things. Which is a real shame. Maybe we are, actually. There's a there's a, a lot more enemies up here than I expected. Careful, big boy, careful. Yes! Okay, director weapon in hand. We did it! Oh my god, that was tough. That was tough. Okay. Active costs unequipped ammo instead of skill. Active deflects and destroys all enemy projectiles. Okay, interesting. Oh yeah, that's, 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 that's pretty good. We got the pop wall. Oh my god, that is quite the wall. When it said wall, I wasn't quite expecting that much. But we did it. We got there with a director weapon. I like that. Big boy here. I don't even know what's going on right now. I need better weaponry. Okay. Not particularly happy with all the big dog boys coming at me. How am I not dead? Okay, I am dead. <laughs> Either way, we did it. I hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next one.